My name is Isaiah Fanua. I was living in the Sandalwood Apartments in Rubido, California. I was in apartment 31. Uh, when we moved in, it was full of cockroaches. Um, our heater wasn't working, electricity wasn't working. Uh, we had electrical fires in the electrical box. Um, we had a hole in our wall for over a month. We had water leaking in there. And it's not just us, as you can see other videos that are loaded up on YouTube about sandalwood for my neighbors. Um, I'm not the only one. I ended up taking them to court on it. The judge wouldn't hear me out, wouldn't listen. He told me he, I, I could talk at the end. And um, he wouldn't look at any of my evidence. He took their evidence, even though I told him that was not photos of my, um, of my apartment. It was a different apartment. Um, at the end, he rendered his verdict that I have to pay $29 a day to stay there. Um, I didn't get evicted, but he didn't do anything to them to fix. He didn't tell them fix anything or order them. Um, so I stayed there. I was getting ready to move, looking for a place. And all of a sudden I got a eviction letter from, uh, served to me from the sheriffs. Um, they ended up going to court on the 11th, filing another eviction on the 11th and going to court. Um, so they told the judge that they served me papers, never served me any papers. I had no idea. If I knew about it, I would have gone to court again. Um, but yeah, I got evicted. Um, my dad had moved in with me. He's old. He's on dialysis. He moved in so I could take him dialysis three times a, a week at three o'clock in the morning to nine o'clock in the morning, dialysis. Um, but yeah, we are, we're evicted and this is where we're staying at. We're at the Palm View Motels here in Rubido. You can see right here. Um, I don't think it's fair that the judge did that to us. And oh yeah, my lawyer um, from the county of Riverside uh, at the beginning told me, hey, you got a great case, we'll get them to fix everything. They didn't do it. Uh, what happened was um, when we went to court the first time, their lawyer came in, my lawyer was surprised to see him, and I guess they knew each other, and she ended up not fighting for me at all. So that's how I lost the case. Um, but yeah, can somebody help us out? Somebody needs to get on Sandalwood Apartments, the owners. Um, Kathy, uh, I forget the, the husband's name, but uh, Kathy, she's the main one. She'll come disrespect all the tenants. They'll, she'll yell at them when they ask her to fix them. She just talks crap to them. She tried to mace me, pepper smear me, as you guys seen in the other video um, when I was asking her for uh, the letter so we can go to court. Um, that's just how these people are. They, they don't care about anybody. Um, everybody's beneath them. Uh, yeah, they just bad people, all out and out bad, bad people. So if you guys are watching this, please share this. Let's make this go viral and get these people. Um, Kevin and Kathy, that's their name. Kevin and Kathy, Sandalwood Apartments, they're the management. Um, I, I have no idea who the owners are. We Nobody tells us anything at those apartments. So, yeah, please help. Thank you.